How are you everyone? Joey here from Zap North Hobart, PT Bender Fitness. Today I'm going to show you the correct form for the pec fly. It's something which is good to warm up the pecs or also to finish after a chest workout. So when we're doing this movement, um, it's easily done very, very incorrectly, but it, with these few examples I'm gonna show you, you're gonna get the right movement done. So what I like to imagine is that we're hugging around a big tree or like a, a, a post. You wanna keep a slight bend in your elbows. Um, so for example, I see a lot of people keeping their arms straight and they'll come around like that. What we wanna do, we wanna keep those bent because when we bend our elbow, you're really gonna incorporate your outer pec and we're gonna cruise around and, and just imagine squeezing down from the side of our pec all the way to the center, giving that nice shape. We keep these elbows bent. I'm gonna bring my chest up, so I'm not gonna have my back flat against the pad. Really squeezing through. We're never gonna go heavy with this movement. We just wanna keep it light. High repetition, 15 to 20, either warm up the pecs at the start of a workout or a good way to finish the chest workout as well. Okay guys, now you know the correct form for doing the pec fly. Major benefits is gonna warm your chest up for a chest workout, get it nice and stretched out, and it's also going to build a nice thickness on that outer pec and shape it off nice out of those sternum. If you know anyone that would benefit from this video, please share it with them. And if you have any questions, comment on Facebook.